Hey everybody, today I'm going to show you Windows XP, PSP. I'm also going to show you two different versions of the iPSP. And I'll also show you um, Vista, Windows Vista for the PSP. Okay, well, the first one right here is iPSP. This is the more kind of advanced um, IPSP. What I mean by that is it's just got more features and stuff like that, but then it also has some difficulties with it. Sometimes a lot of things don't work, but, uh, if you can see, it's got photo games, and then that's the lock button, clock, calendar, weather, Safari browser, which is the browser for Apple, you know, and then email, iPod, that's, um, instant messaging. Also up here, it has a reception bar, but that's fake, that's just for, you know, looks, makes it look real. And then also the battery charge level, that's fake too. It says right here, Sony PlayStation, um, portable. Let me, I'll show you a little something of one of the features here. I'll show you Safari, this is Safari, the browser. Um, it tells you to turn your PSP every time, you know. Okay, um, this is Safari, you know, same thing as the internet, just different browser, a little different look, basically. Menu, okay. And then, let me show you, uh, something. Here's the clock, um, which is one of the things, the more advanced feature, which is this one. Only this one has the clock. The basic IPSP doesn't have the clock. This is it right here, though. Um, nothing special, just that. And then, um, I'm going to go back to it. The menu. And so that's basically about all that's on the, uh, this version of IPSP. I want to show you the um, other version. Just less, you know, stuff on it. More basic one. Okay. I believe it's this one. Okay. Every time it asks you if you want to do, asks you if you want to play this plugin, you just say yes. Um, okay, this one, as you can see, it doesn't have the clock, you know. Also, the game, it's a rearranged a little differently. This one has about nine buttons. The other one has about twelve. It's got dig though, calculator, weather, lock, you know, game, safari, about the same thing, mail, blah blah blah, instant messaging. Let me show you um, the lock real quick. It's kind of like putting your iPod on hold or something. You know, um, okay, this is it right here. So it just displays the time and the day. I don't have a control for Then to unlock it, um, you have to go down to this button here. It says slide to unlock. So I hold down and I slide it. And then there you go. It brings you back to the main menu. So that's about all in this one. So now let me show you uh, Vista. Windows Vista for PSP. Okay, go down here. Vista. And every time you go to this, it has a login screen too, which is kind of cool, you know. Makes it seem more realistic like you're usually using Vista. So here's the login screen. Now I can go down here, type in the password. Okay. Uh, okay. And then hit enter. And then this is it. It's kind of like um, Vista. Of course, it has way less features. Just a little portal. It's got the background time down here. Right here it says My PSP Internet Calculator, Text Editor, Games, and Music, basically. And then it's got, let's go down to the little menu bar right here. And it'll bring up the menu bar, like on a. Oh, I guess it's still loading. Okay, here we go. And then, you know, down here it's got games, programs, it's even got antivirus, all that is is you just select a file out of your PSP, you choose one, and then you just click scan. So you have to do it kind of like file by file. And it also got control panel, show you control panel real quick. Oops, kind of hard to maneuver on this. Okay, and every time you click on something, it'll bring up this little box to load it. And here we are. This is control panel, as you can see, it's got display, sound, system, taskbar, system settings, and screensaver. You can change in the logins. I think you can make several accounts. I'm not sure. I haven't tried that yet. Let me check real quick. Okay, no, you can't. I guess you can only have one account at a time. So, yeah, it's definitely not as good as an actual Vista or nothing. And then you, it's got minimized bars too and maximized and so you can actually have multiple windows open. And it's also got, you know, the whole programs list. 
when you go under to all programs right here and it brings up that it's, it's mainly just games and little miniature versions coin flip cloud calendar um, date of birth dice roll it has a free phone program I guess you can make free phone calls I haven't tried that yet um, you know I just didn't want it to charge me but it says it's free and then here PSP paint text editor stuff like that okay now let me show you Windows XP this Windows this version of the Windows XP really isn't that great it's nothing really actually um, okay here it is really all it is it's, it doesn't even have the time it just says Sony picture of the hill like on a regular and then a little tiny start menu right there let me click on that and that's all it just brings up this it's nothing as good as the Vista version games and applications and that's all it brings up to-do list calendar and calculator so well that's all um, if you'd like to download any of these versions it, the wet links to the website to not to um, download it from will be in my video description so if you like the PSP um, for Windows XP or iPhone or any of that, just look at my video description. The websites will be in there to download it. Um, so yeah, that's all.